play clock at two. Pressured again, trying to set up the screen. They get it to Fields. Tigers are there. Second wave comes, and it's a loss of three. A tape. And Tom, the question was really what's going to be an option from under center. Obviously, they're doing a lot of option from the gun, which is more like Georgia Southern under Willie Fritz a couple years ago. They're 0 for 5 on third downs. Works pressured. Gets hog tied in the backfield by Derek Brown. Georgia Southern going backwards that time. You see it right here. Drives his man all the way back. That is why he was a former five. 20 games in a row at one point. Brad Pitt, really? Oh, you saw Moneyball, didn't you? Mm. Billy Bean. You get the idea. <laughs> it always says when you have the lead, fourth quarter pass rush is so important to putting a game away. And we've seen it really in the fourth quarter. We saw it in the third quarter. For Auburn since 2001. Back to the running game. Not good. I mean, how many times has Auburn brought pressure, or gotten to Kelly without bringing an extra man. They do it here. And the ball got loose. Kicked out of bounds by Auburn. A quick hitter to the outside. I thought he had Miko Hardman wide open too, but now it's Swift, only a yard. Derek Brown made the tackle. Number five right there is healthy and a big motor. He wins. And you can see that time he just threw away Solomon Kenley that time. Number Tuck and go. 23 yards. Handoff and a body slam. Oh my goodness. One of the most pressured kicks of his life. And it's blocked. The Auburn special teams. To Derek Brown. He had the body slam a few plays earlier. He gets the Ricky Haley with the safety. He's a guy that some NFL scouts have been taking a look at for Alabama State. Here's Talisian Farmer carrying no game. One of eight on third down. The Hornets. Here comes some pressure off the edge of the sack for Derek Brown. His pass is on the season. A little delay. Handoff. Boy, nothing happening there. Little reverse and then throwing off of it. Abraham. He is dropped to the turn. High school in Warner Robins, Georgia. Boy, it looked like there was a little bit of a hole, but just as quickly as it was there, it was gone. Derek Brown steps in to hit Tim Jordan. Handoff, nothing there for Madre London. Never could get started. Cool there, just no push up front by this by this offensive line of Tennessee. Four. To Amu decides to run into traffic. Can he recognize what he needs to recognize now? Second and thirteen. Five man rush. Ma hit it. The ball comes out. The officials, I believe, have ruled that a fumble. Struggle to score touchdowns. And Holyfield right on cue, stacked up. We thought this is a part of the field where we might see Justin Fields. A tight bunch of receivers to the right and Swift on his left hip. From running out of time, running to the line of scrimmage, and that's as far as he'll get. They've blown the play dead. Crowd kept cheering. One matchup because it's been a rough day for Blau. The give is to Markel Jones, and he is devoured by Derek Brown and Dontavius Russell at the line of scrimmage. It will be Auburn ball. Well, that's a highlight reel there play for, for Derek Brown. And if you don't know who this kid is, he'll be uh, one of the first players taken in the draft. Just a phenomenal force, like you're exempt from death. From death. Because you're so young and you're so vibrant. And... To be able to witness a young man endure this time has been has been has been great experience for them to be able to understand that life is so precious and valuable. Hard run there that LT you'd imagine would be proud of and Bradwell driven back. Whose idea was it to run at Derek Brown? Bodie's in the backfield with him. 
Brody takes it, trying to get the edge, and there is great news for Auburn fans as Derek Brown gets the tackle for loss in the backfield. Played all but one. Outfield quiet on third and long. Vaughn stepping up this time, and he is dropped. This big Derek Brown, the senior Lanier High School kid. <laughs> So you want to be a quarterback. Well, you just sit in the pocket. Your eyes are down the field. You're looking at what coach told you, and then a mass of humanity wearing number five. A quarterback you. or a right guard. Vaughn <laughs> makes it. Pressure to Cam Brown. Hits it. Be a Loose That's football a picked off. <laughs> On second and goal. Vaughn looking. Tipped. And it is incomplete over the middle. Third and goal. To the back of the end zone. Derek Brown. Oh, good job by Brown tipping the ball, but back in the end zone is kind of a sweet spot in this defense right now. Some of these big receivers are going to be able to have to make a play back there. Trask in the shotgun. He'll get the call and yeah. gets collared immediately Steve. by Derek Brown, <laughs> of course. Just before the clock expired, Trask hit from behind. The ball is out. Derek Brown scoops it for Auburn. The big fella going down the sideline, showing his speed. Whoops. Oh, my goodness. The turf monster got him at the 34-yard line. Time of possession of the game. They're using all of the clock here, too. Trask. And he's hit. Ball is out. The big fella's got it again. Derek Brown took it right off his hand. I just said they were tired. How could you do that when you're tired? Because he's going to be a millionaire next year. <laughs> exactly. Offensive tackle position. Goes up against a veteran player, just pushes right. Actually, he got two guys. Heggie had him at first, number 61, but he pushes right through Heggie, reaches out his left hand, and steals it. <laughs> I'm not sure if that's a fumble return or an interception, but we'll give it to him. We talked about his toughness last week, and he just took a wick, wicked lick. Here's Barrett Brown again. Coordinator for four years. The best thing they've done this year of all his years is take the ball away. Yeah, player running on late. It is Derek Brown, and he wound up in the exact right spot. Is running out of the game, and big Derek Brown's running on the field, and he ran right into the play. I mean, there's no way that he could have guessed that he was going to make this tackle. I think that he's going to throw a good-looking pass into a tight window. I mean, you almost give away that it's a run. We saw that in third. And he's standing up to rush this time, and Brian Heron. Guess who? For a three -yard Guess who's on the bottom of that tackle? It's got the ankles this time. I think it's number five. That's who I'd go with. <laughs> Watch him kind of sneak in there, split the double team, dive in, and make the tackle. Okay. Under center this time. Play action. That one wobbled out of the hand, unless that was hit by somebody. Had to be. Derek Brown, maybe. <laughs> Derek Brown right in the middle. Gets in there and gets a hand on it. Yep. Match up against Kinley. That's man against man there, and he gets the left paw. Derek Brown, one of the big time recruits at Georgia. Including George Pickens. It's Herring again, though, and they are playing it conservatively. No game might have gotten a half yard out of it. I don't know how you can play so hard against all those big guys and have a smile on your face the whole game. <laughs> he played off two blockers, maybe three, and made the tackle. And come up smiling. Doesn't get it. Goes back to the ground to Harris. And this time he's stuffed for a yard loss. Derrick Brown and company up front. Second and short, Brian Robinson slips, and he's leveled in the backfield by Derrick Brown. Third down coming up. Well, the big guy's got in there a few times, but the ball's been going. Oh, this time he just schools. Deontay Brown, number 65. Did you see that quickness? Strong as an ox, and he beats Brown off the line of scrimmage. Brown just falls down. Third and goal. Jones bobbled the snap a little bit. Throws as it knocked down by Derek Brown. It comes back to Jones. Completes it to himself, but lost a yard. And Kevin Steele did go coverage. He played zone on the play. He backed off. Derek Brown couldn't get there, but he was in the line of fire, and he knocked it down. What a monster on the inside. He is. Evan Neal did a good job.